What's up, Scorpio? Welcome to Profound Effect Tarot. I'm Brandon Lickey. And right now I'll be doing a reading for all Scorpios. This is going to be a general health spread. And I'm also going to get you some added messages from the money and law of attraction cards. So let's get right into it. Hope you all are having a great Saturday. Okay, now the first card that I get for you, Scorpio, is the Four of Pentacles. And with the Four of Pentacles coming out, this is telling you that right now you're hoarding your money, you're holding on to things, you're saving. And this is very good for you, if that is what you are doing. Um, this is also telling you to hold back from uh, making any big purchases right now. Or just to hold on to anything that's valuable to you. Not to give away anything valuable. To sell anything valuable for money or anything that, uh, that means a lot to you. To hold on to your valuable items. Yeah, because there's, there's something on the way to you. I get, uh, it could be someone from your past, with the Six of Cups coming out here. Uh, someone is uh, returning to you, and I'm getting there's, there's just a lot of things coming to you faster than you think right now. The uh, Six of Cups in the reverse has to do with the future arriving very soon. So, there's a lot of surprises on the way to you. Make sure you prepare yourself. Make sure you save your money. Make sure you have all the resources you need to be prepared for any bumps in the road or anything unexpected because there's a lot of things coming your way. The future is arriving sooner than you think. And you have to find the balance. Right now I get that your balance is a little bit out of whack. Um, you could be trying to find time for family and work or uh, work and relationships. And this is just causing um, a lot of bumps in the road for your emotions. Just like these these rough seas back here. That's how your emotions have been. A lot of ups and downs. And it's just been tough for you to um, find consistency in your schedule. I get to, to hang in there. Um, and to uh, you, you will become more flexible. I see you're becoming more flexible. You're finding more time. You're saving your resources, which is what you need to continue to do. Uh, Scorpio, you need to continue to save your resources. You know, regardless if somebody's like, oh yeah, you're being selfish because you're not paying for this, you're not doing this. You have, you have a lot of things you need to prepare for coming your way. So Continue to save. Continue to be conservative. And you will get the financial freedom that you desire. The, the Nine of Pentacles is a uh, has to do with independence. This is an independent woman right here. She has freedom, financial freedom. Uh, this is a card of great riches, great success, harmony. So you will find harmony, happiness, great success here. It's coming in the near future. You have a lot of money coming your way faster than you think with this Six of um, Six of uh, Cups coming out here. So yeah. You have financial independence, a lot of money coming your way faster than you think. You may need to save up for a big purchase, a big investment. Yeah, investment. Seven of Pentacles, all about investment. This is that proud farmer who invested all that time tilling the fields and growing these crops. Now he's just waiting for them to bear fruit. You invested the time into a big project, you're waiting to bear fruit. And it's going to bear fruit sooner than you think. You may feel like you've been waiting forever. You've been putting time and effort into this project forever. But it's going to come together for you. Yeah, the star card. It's a card of futuristic thinking. This is a good omen card. 
So this means that your desires will manifest. Everything that you put work into the star card is telling you that it's going to happen. It's, it's Everything is, is on its way to you. This card of the Aquarius here. Could be an Aquarius on the way to you. But yeah, I get that everything that you put energy into is going to manifest. And to hang in there, be patient. The hangman coming up. This is telling you you gotta exercise patience to hang in there. Everything that you want will come to fruition. And I'm gonna leave it there for you. Short and sweet. I'm gonna get you a card here from the uh, get you to add a message from the Law of Attraction deck. Okay, the card that I got for you is I want to harmonize with what I believe is good. I want to harmonize with what I believe is good. And go ahead and read the message on the back. Scorpio, it says, I want to be the best that I can be. I want to do and have and live in a way that is in harmony with my idea of greatest goodness. I want to harmonize physically here in this body with that which I believe to be the best or the good way of life. If you will make those statements, and then do not take action unless you feel good, you will always be in harmony with your idea of that which is good. And that is your reading, Scorpio. If it resonates with you, make sure you claim it in the comments section down below. Make sure you like the video. Resonates with you as well, and make sure that you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the videos next week. Yeah, hit that bell too, so you don't miss the notification when it comes in. And to help us grow here, Profound Effect Tarot to motivate me to keep doing these readings each and every week, and to keep building on the channel. Make sure you donate to my Cash App, my PayPal, and my Venmo. All that information will be included in the description box below the video, so you can do that there. And I want to say I appreciate you all so much for tuning in like you do every week. God bless you, and y'all have a great Saturday.